With this question, it's really important to understand what's going on here. This graph shows distance on the y-axis, and it shows how long it took on the x-axis. So it shows how long they took to walk from home to their school. So if they left at 8 o'clock, it took them from 8 o'clock to 8.30 to reach school. Okay, You could should be able to see that school is 2 kilometres away, because during that time they go from 0 to 2. If we look at a time in the middle, somewhere like 8.15, which is about there, then they should have re they should have reached halfway. So between eight and eight fifteen, they walked one kilometer, and between eight fifteen and eight thirty, they walked the second kilometer. This bit. It's really important to try and understand the graph before you answer the question. So how does the graph show that Alfie walked at a constant speed? Well, a good answer to this is that it's a straight line, or the angle is the same or you can see that the gradient is the same. You could also say, as we just discussed, that between 8 and 8.15 he walks one kilometre, and between 8.15 and 8.30 he walks another kilometre. So that shows he's travelling at a constant speed. Question B says that Alfie's brother left home 10 minutes before Alfie, and he arrived at school 20 minutes afterwards and he walked at a constant speed. We now know that constant speed means that he will also travel, his graph will also be a straight line. We need to draw this on the graph, there's no other way of doing it. Let's do that now. Okay, so here's the line, the red line is Alfie's brother. He left 10 minutes before, so he left at 7.50, and he arrived at school, remember that's two kilometres away, at school, he arrived at 8.50, which is 20 minutes later than Alfie, who, left at eight, who arrived at 8.30. So he arrived at 8.50. So now we're looking, this is Alfie's brother, there he is, walking to school. We're looking at when the two lines cross, because here's Alfie leaving later, and at 10 past 8, Alfie's line, the black line, crosses the red line. So here's Alfie's brother moving much slower along the red line, Alfie moves quicker because his line is steeper and they cross at ten past eight. So that will be the answer.